Welcome to our channel, Olive Girls Garden. Today we're gonna show you how to grow potatoes. You can grow potatoes from the store-bought potatoes. It's very easy to do. Just make sure when you get them to wash them good, that they put like a chemical on them so they won't make them so they won't sprout. So you just wash them off good and leave them out of the refrigerator and they will start to sprout like this. You get a little sprouting eyes on it. Once you get the little sprouting eyes on it, you can take it, take your knife and cut it, like right along where the eyes at. And you can make like three pieces out of this one. Like that. So let this dry for like three or four days before you plant it. So it will rot. You have to let it dry. I have some dry pieces already here that already been cut up already. And you can grow even the small yard, an apartment, you still can grow your own vegetables. They always taste better when you grow them yourself. So let's get started. We're gonna start with this bucket here. We're gonna put about six inches of soil in the bottom of it. I already have it mixed up right here. Some potted soil, some some uh, some garden soil mixed up right here which about six inches in in the container and once you get that in there then you can start putting the potatoes in it Heavy feeders. So you gotta feed them to get out to a good start. And also, you can use essence salt. It's more for just good for your feet. You also can use it in your garden. See, it's essence salt for gardens. And you can put a little bit of that in there too. Sprinkle a little bit of that in there. And then you mix it all up, get it all in the soil. You gotta get it all mixed up, blending together. Then you start putting your potatoes in. These ones were already cut like four days ago. You put the eyes up. You put them in the container. This is a pretty big container, so we probably going to do uh, maybe six or seven. You keep the eyes pointed up. Yeah, I think maybe one more. One smaller one. Like that. Then you cover it back up next. Put some more soil, about six inches of more soil. I didn't water it because it's been raining. So it's supposed to rain again today, so I'm not gonna water it. And don't forget to put holes in the bottom of your bucket. You gotta have holes in the bottom of your bucket. Then I'm gonna put a little bit more on top. You don't have to, but get you a nice good harvest of potatoes. Somewhere around the end of June, middle of July, they should be ready to harvest. See, let's mix it in the soil a little bit. So on the few mushrooms, they have some white potatoes. So it ain't very hard to do. Make sure you put the holes in your buckets in the bottom. You can get these from like Walmart for like $5. Put them on your patio, your backyard, however you want to do it. So we got a couple more to do. So we uh gonna leave you there and make sure to like and subscribe to Oligar Gardens. Until next time. Bye.